Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to construct a quadrilateral when three angles and two adjacent sides are given. We need to remember here, those two adjacent sides must be the included sides between these angles when we start drawing. Let's first see the dimensions. Now here we see we have been given three angles, angle J, angle A, and angle D, and also given sides J and AD. Now first thing, let's check whether these sides are adjacent. J and AD, one common letter, that means these are adjacent sides. One tick mark. Now let's see these sides are included between these angles or not. Angle J and angle A, the included side is J. Yes, so J is included side. Angle A and angle D, included side is AD. Yes, AD is a included side. So both the requirements are fulfilled here. Now what happens if they have not given the side which is included side? It's easy. There are three angles given. Using the angle sum property of a quadrilateral, we can find the fourth angle. And the moment we find fourth angle, the side which was not included becomes included side. So here the important thing is that we need to have sides adjacent. That is must. And before drawing, we should check whether these two sides are also included side. If not, find the fourth angle. That way we will have these sides automatically included sides. Let's draw the rough diagram. And now we will start drawing. To start drawing, draw any of these sides. No restriction. You can draw any side. So let's draw our first side. We have drawn J which is equal to 5.2 centimeters. Now we will draw the angles J and angle A using protractor. We know how to draw an angle using protractor. We have to align the vertex with the center of the protractor, choose the zero scale which is aligned to the side. So there are two zeros, one on the left and one on the right. We need to check which side angle we want to draw. Since from J we want to draw angle towards A, which is right hand side, so we will use the scale where zero is on the right hand side for drawing angle J. We draw angle J which is equal to 65 degrees. Now we want to draw angle A which is 135 degrees, but this time the angle is on the left hand side. So zero of the left hand side has to be used as the scale. We draw 135 degrees. And now we look at the second side. Second side is 85 centimeter. We take 5 centimeter in compass, put the sharp end of compass on point A and draw an arc that will cut this side and we get point D. Now the last angle, angle D equal to 92 degrees. Keeping the protractor on this line, aligning the point D with the center of the protractor. We want to draw angle which is towards A, which is left hand side. So we'll use the left hand side zero scale and find out 92 degrees and draw the line. Where these two lines intersect, that is our point U. Thus we have drawn the quadrilateral JADU where we knew two adjacent sides and three angles. What is must? Two adjacent sides is must. Three angles. Out of the three angles, if those three angles do not include these two sides, then find the fourth angle and you will see that the sides given will be included sides. I am sure you have liked the video. Hit the like button and leave your views in the comment section below. Do watch our other videos on this topic. Subscribe our channel and click the bell icon to get notifications whenever we upload new videos. You may also download the QTube app at the link provided in the video description. Till we meet again, goodbye.